Hi angels, I hope you're all doing well and welcome back to another episode of Winners Wednesday. If you are new to my channel, every single week on Wednesday I do some sort of winners content. So it's either a shop with me where I bring you shopping in store or I do a haul showing you all the items I picked up recently from Winners, Marshalls, HomeSense. So today I am doing a Winners and HomeSense haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure to hit that big red subscribe button down below. It's completely free and I'd love to have you as part of our YouTube family. Also give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see more winners hauls and also hit the bell notification next to the subscribe button and YouTube will notify you every time I upload. So let's go ahead and get into what I bought recently from winners. Now I have to admit this haul is not as big as some of my other hauls. I have two small bags here. I really haven't been buying as much from Winners lately just because I have so much and I've been receiving so much in PR, which is such an incredible blessing. I have to film a PR haul. I think I'm going to film it after this one. So you will be seeing that soon. If you are interested in seeing my PR haul, make sure you are subscribed so you do not miss out. But I've been getting so much in PR, which I'm so, so lucky to receive. And Christmas is coming up, so I don't want to buy a lot in case Santa brings me some things for Christmas. So I just haven't been buying as much, but I still want to show you the few really great things that I did buy. Some of these items you would have seen in last week's shop with me, but some of them I have not shown yet. So if you haven't watched last week's video, I will leave it linked in the iCards and you can go ahead and watch it after this one. So the first thing I want to show you is my favorite item I picked up from winners in a while. Definitely my favorite from the past few weeks. How adorable is this little gingerbread man? You know, sometimes you just see things in store and they call to you and you just know you have to buy them. There was only one of these at my winners and I hadn't seen him before. So he's actually a microwavable pillow. So I'm pretty sure he's meant for children, but that doesn't matter because I still wanted to get him. So he actually has beans in his butt and you can take out the beans and heat them up in the microwave. So this would be so good for kids if they just come in from a snowy day, if they're not feeling well, also for adults like me. If you are someone who suffers from cramps, this may be a good thing to get. So you heat this little bag of beans up in the microwave and then you just slip it back inside his back here. But really, I just got him as Christmas decor. I thought he would make the perfect little throw pillow for my couch for the Christmas season. I just love him. I just had to have him. And he was only $14.99. So I feel like you can't even get a throw pillow for that much. And he's quite a good size. So he is the perfect size to put on my couch as a holiday decor piece. So let me know if you have seen him at your stores. They had a ton of these microwavable pillows in every type of animal you could imagine. I think I showed a few of them in my video, if not last week, the week before, but they have hedgehogs, tigers, lions, sloths, everything. Ralph just came to the door and wanted to come say hi. He's wearing his plaid Christmas sweater today. Now they also had a lot of really cute Christmas pajamas and nightgowns at my winners. This one isn't a Christmas nightgown, but I still thought it was really nice. It looked so cozy. So this is from Calvin Klein. It is a long sleeve nightgown and it is this kind of, I wanna say thermal material. It's not waffle, but it's kind of similar. And I just thought this looked so comfortable. So this was only $24.99 from Calvin Klein. Now in next week's video, I will be showing you all the amazing clearance footwear that I found at Winners. But just to give you a heads up now, because they'll probably sell out really quickly, check out your footwear section in your local Winners or Marshalls because they had so much on clearance. I couldn't believe that they already had winter boots on clearance because winter has really just started, but they already had a ton of boots, flats, heels, sandals, sneakers, everything on clearance. So I picked up these Sherpa slides. If you follow me 
on Instagram or TikTok, you know I am obsessed with this Sherpa material. I know so many people are loving this material right now. It is super trendy. I love that we are seeing just about everything in this Teddy material. But these are a black Sherpa slide from Steve Madden, and these were on clearance. Now, it kind of makes sense that these are on clearance because they are a sandal, but I'll just wear them inside or I'll save them until next summer. So you could use these as slippers or sandals because they do have a herd bottom. So these were on clearance. They were originally $29.99, which is already a good price, but I got them on sale for, but I got these on sale for $24. I thought those were, that was such a great deal and they had them in my size. So it was a sign, it was fate. I did pick these up. Like I said, they had so much amazing clearance footwear. They had cougar boots on sale, really, really nice ones. You will see those in next week's video. But for now, if you are in Winners or Marshalls, definitely check out the footwear clearance section. Okay, now I have two more items left and they are from the beauty section. I left my favorite beauty finds until last. So the first one here is Creme de la Creme, our most loved scents in one set. So this is Le Jet Set. Now, I think I've seen people talk about this brand of fragrance before. I'm pretty sure it's a very expensive brand. This is Le Monde Gourmand. Let me know if you've heard of this brand before. So this is a set of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven travel size fragrances. So you get seven of their best selling fragrances. I also just love the colors of these. This would make such a great gift or stocking stuffer. It's vegan and cruelty free and this was $19.99. Now I haven't seen this fragrance brand sold really anywhere in Canada so I wanted to pick this up and give them a try. Let me know if you have heard of this brand or tried anything from this brand. And the last item I was so excited to find, I could hardly believe my eyes, we did see the ABH subculture palette at Winners. They have a ton of them at my local Winners locations, but this is the first time I've seen this palette from ABH. So this is the Sultry palette, and this was a really big seller for them, I believe. I think this palette did really well, and I've heard amazing things about this palette, so I'm shocked to see it at Winners. They only had one at my Winners location, and it was buried in behind so many other products. I always say this to you, when you are at Winners or Marshalls, you have to really get down on your hands and knees and dig around in the beauty section because sometimes there are some hidden treasures hiding behind a lot of the other products. So this was $29.99 and their palettes usually retail I believe for at least $50 or $60 so you're getting about half off. But this packaging is just stunning. It's a sparkly brown packaging. And then this is what the palette looks like inside. I'm sure you've seen this before, but it's mainly a neutral palette with a pop of pink. I thought this would be such a great everyday palette to have, especially, oh, that was just the brush. I was scared it was an eyeshadow. Especially since I am getting more into wearing eyeshadow lately. Today I am wearing the Pat McGrath um, Mothership Odyssey, the big holiday palette they came out with. I love that palette. It makes doing eyeshadow so easy. If you're someone who isn't really good with eyeshadow or you want to experiment and you haven't tried Pat McGrath's formula and you want to try out some of her shadows, that palette is only $100, which I know sounds like a lot, but most of her palettes are 160, 170, so that's actually a pretty good deal and you get a lot of different shades and gorgeous shades for the holidays. As you can see, I'm wearing this shimmer on my lids and then this kind of dark brown on the outer edge. Okay, my loves, that is the end of today's Winners and Home Sense haul. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was a shorter video, but I still hope you enjoyed seeing what I did pick up over the last couple weeks at Winners and Home Sense. Definitely let me know in the comments down below which item from my haul was your favorite or what deals you have found at your local winners lately. As always, thank you all so much for watching. It means the world to me, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.